So I'm here at with Delta 9, John, the CEO of Delta 9. Pleasure meeting you and thank you for taking your time. Thank you for having me. So a lot of our investors obviously know about Delta 9. They know about your company because it's a publicly traded company. But I thought for all of our investors obviously who couldn't be here, they've been in the United States and other parts of Canada, they couldn't get here. And that's what we're doing right now is giving a little exposure for all the people who are here. So for anybody who doesn't know about your company or may only know a little bit, can you tell us a little bit about Delta 9? Yeah, no, thank you. So we're uh, uh, Delta 9 Cannabis. We're one of Canada's oldest licensed producers, actually. we were. Licensed for cultivation in uh, in 2013 and uh, and for sale in early 2014. Now since then we've been uh, I guess refining our growth techniques and uh, last year we really started to to push the growth trajectory. So over the year 2017 we raised 34 million dollars. Uh, we listed our shares on the Toronto Venture Exchange uh, under the symbol NINE. Uh, fully funded now for a, a huge ramp up in production capacity over the next few years. And, you know, real differentiator in the story is is our Delta 9 grow pods, uh, our vertical integration into retail, uh, sales of genetics, and, and these proprietary grow, grow systems as well. Yeah, and, and, and the pods. So I know a lot of people, even if they are investing in your company, funny enough, don't look into the pods. It's a very unique aspect where, for those who are watching, they're growing pods. Are they shipping containers, like that type of size for the pods? And instead of having large grows, you have these pods so you could better mitigate against the risk uh, of obviously getting mites or anything like that, but just in general, it's such a unique thing where you can stack them as well. Are you able to talk a little bit more about the pods for anyone who doesn't know? Absolutely, yeah. So uh, our uh, grow systems, we call them the Delta 9 grow pods. They're a, a proprietary unit, and we hold Canadian and U.S. patents on them. But effectively, they're a standard 40-foot high cube shipping container, so regular intermodal shipping container. We install customized wall panels. We coat the entire interior with vinyl and epoxy. It gives us hospital grade cleanable surfaces. We install electrical, uh, lighting, independent HVAC systems and water systems. Uh, what we're left with is now a unit that's modular, it's scalable. It's ultimately stackable within our licensed facility as well. The benefits, you know, as you alluded to, uh, several fold. It gives us a very high level of control over the grow environment, which means all those factors that contribute to product quality, light intensity, uh, parts per million CO2, all these factors can be dialed in. Gives us a superior quality of product. It's also an inherent risk mitigation strategy. Prevents the spread or possible spread of disease or, or pests throughout our production facility. And when we compare that to a big open greenhouse, you know, again, there's a lot of value at risk there, and we mitigate that effectively with our pod model. Yeah, and I, I've always thought it was one of the most interesting things when I looked into you guys at first, uh, sometime last year, uh, looking into it from an investor standpoint, but thinking, like, I, I've never seen this before. And as you start talking to more people, and especially that mitigation of risk, I know you also have a, a lot of reasons you're doing it, but the mitigation of risk, when these large grows, if they have any problem, and if that spreads, that's millions of dollars gone. Uh, and then obviously you do everything you can not to have that, but it's growing a plant, you never know. But here's, it, it's been it's just each pie, which is, a, I don't know why more people aren't doing it. it it's very interesting. Well, we are starting to sell the pods as now, uh, yeah. so hopefully uh, people are seeing uh, the, the benefits uh, that, that we're starting to see. And, I mean, the other argument is really economic uh, for the pods. And, uh, I think it's a very lean CapEx model. So uh, each grow pod on, on a full conversion basis costs us $28,000. And that pod is capable of putting out $300,000 a year in dollar value output products. So about 10 times the capital investment per year, every year. So now, I mean, we're to a point where we're moving in about four new pods a week into our facility. So we're moving in $1.2 million a week in additional grow capacity, and that's coming online every week. So it's a great uh, well, great growth trajectory for the company, I think. No, absolutely, absolutely. And, and like I said, I appreciate your time very much. Uh, Delta 9, you could, are you guys on the TSX Venture? TSX Venture, yeah, N-I-N-E. -E, and our warrants actually trade publicly as well. It's a great way to take a leveraged look at Delta 9. Uh, those trade under N-I-N-E.W-T. Absolutely. Well, thank you very much for your time. I appreciate it. I hope you have a great uh, last weekend at the Lithia Expo. I hope everyone enjoyed.